This is not going on the burgers, if you're wondering. Huh? It is rainy outside, so yeah. he's decided we're going to cook. Yeah, I'm going to cook today. He's putting together some peanut butter We have now. found found the loin in the freezer we didn't know we had. And we have the deer loin. Mine. We're going to wrap it in bacon for later. Mine. Got the burgers going for now. Cookies about to be going for after the burgers. It's a day to stay inside, watch TV, and eat. Mm. Also, we want to know what you eat on your burgers. We like this pineapple. Well, we don't really prefer the pineapple preserves. What is it that we like? The, the pineapple, jalapeno. pineapple jalapeno spread. But we could usually only find that homemade, and it's very, uh, what do you call it? It's, we, got we got the card, but yeah, we just ain't got no more yet. But anyway, this will work. Pineapple preserves on the bun. I'm going to try some peach habanero from a local Sam's Town Market in Mantachi, Mississippi. This Smuckers could be purchased from any local Walmart. Who are the people with the, let's see, I'm about to put their, put their card right here. Well, it's their business card. Anyway, it's Papa's Pickles. I'll, I'll try to post it. Look at the. There they are, right there. Papa's Gourmet Pickles. Go oh, check them out. <laughs> yeah, go check them out. They're on Facebook, so yeah. I'll try to find their Facebook and link it in the description. Also, I'll link Sam's Town Market's Facebook page on there, too, if y'all are interested. But anyway, comment below and let us know what y'all eat on your hamburgers. i to put some buns in the oven and toast. Cookies going in the oven. My hamburger is built. I put some jalapeno jelly on Jalapeno! It. He put some mayonnaise, some pineapple. Mustard kitchen. And we're going to have some wavy lays funions. Flavored funions flavored, isn't that? Yeah. Say these is burnt. But this is the best way to do it. The only way. They probably can't hear from Meekum going in the background. Oh, you can't he cook likes cookies a good burnt and cook cookie. all day without having a car auction in the background. He likes a good hard cookie. Oh, if they had a soft cookie, they might well go to garbage. Cookie's supposed to have some crunch to it. Got that loint. Seasoning her up. Just lightly there. Let's some show the seasoning. Huh? You gotta like put it down and like show it like right here. He don't want to show y'all the seasoning. He ain't giving away the secrets, he said. I tried. Here comes some more seasoning. I guess y'all can just guess. <laughs> guess of the combats what the seasoning is. And here comes some more. Ooh, I bet they can guess what that is. Doubt it. They'll guess this one for sure. Yeah. I wished we had some. Hold on. Yeah. Okay. Y'all didn't hear that part. I paused it and told him. <laughs> All right. How's that for some up close seasoning action on that venison loin? Oh, venison. venison. Now we got some more seasoning. 
It's all a mystery, people. It's all a mystery. <laughs> oh, no. It's a mystery. And here I am. I'm going to cut all the bacon. Oh, well, they know what this is. <laughs> I wish we had cream cheese. Cream cheese would be so good in between the bacon and the loin. Yeah. Just letting y'all know. And also, if you got some jalapenos, please slice them up and put them in there with the uh, cream cheese. You'll thank us later if you like some spice. A little kick. It's really good. Yeah. I guess you'll just have to guess the season. <laughs> Do your own. Yeah. You could probably do this, I guess, with a pork loin or any kind of loin. Anything. Any kind of loin. Yeah. Just hook it up. Bacon's good on anything. God, it is so loud in the back. What is that? Don't need to cut it now. No. It's too late now. We're two minutes in. I'm telling you some cream cheese. Mm. We don't have it? No. It's probably out of date. I can check. Hold on. Didn't have any. Now we're back. Yeah. In the meantime, we're back to cooking again. I am cooking funnel cakes. I'm excited. So first we got some flour, and then we're going to put some sugar in there, and then some, what else, some eggs, some vanilla. Mix it all together. OMG. Put it up in this pan right here, in this little ring, drizzle it over in there, and then when you take it out, put some powdered sugar on it. Oh. Got some funnel cakes ready. Pookie is whipping up some cornbread. You like cornbread? cornbread. Mm. Cornbread I'm done. To look at this cornbread. Y'all can't mess with me. <laughs> Cut it open. Y'all go on Let's try. say slice her up. Y'all go on try. You can't mess with me and my cornbread. Let's say. Mm. I'm gonna get that bite right there real quick. You don't hear that? Good. cornbread. Looks good, Pookie. Tastes good. Mmm. What kind of beans we got to go with it? Black eyed peas. Black eyed peas. Yeah. Mm. We forgot to tell y'all. He about put... About the old zesty Italian. I'm going to tell you about that. He put some zesty Italian. You gotta have that. Peas. <whistles> Deviled eggs. We're Y'all about to get quit. down. Might not do much else for the rest of the day. Subscribe. <laughs>